Hey guys, it is Crafty Awareness and we're back with another cash stuffing video of the week. So, let's get started. The cash breakdown for the week. Now, I already took out $25 and I'm transferring that to savings challenges for tomorrow. So, we're actually going to be doing a total of $283 today. So there is 11 ones for 11, 6 fives for 30, 7 tens for 70, 8 twenties for 160, and 6 twos for $12 equaling $283. All right, so I did rearrange my binders so I don't flippity flip. Because <laughs> I'm sure some of you, it, it was probably a little annoying for some of you guys. And I, I know it was for me. So I'm happy that everything's just going to be in order as I stuff these envelopes. Okay, so I actually calculated how much money I have left to pay my brother back. And his envelope is actually a total of $120, which is exactly how much I owe him uh, left. So what I'm going to do from now till the end of October, I'm still gonna stuff his envelope $20 a week, but I'm gonna start coloring his envelope so it'll be a really good indicator that I'm almost there. <laughs> so let me see what color. You know what, let's do magenta. So if you guys are curious why his envelope is purple, our middle name is Delos Reyes, which means of the kings. So he likes purple because it's the color of royalty. Because he truly believes that we're related to some type of royal person in history. We don't know. <laughs> Maybe. Okay, so I'm going to actually go backwards on this. So I'll start off with the 15. And then I'll color in the five over here. So now let's stuff it with 20 and there should be a total of 60 in here. Yep, so $60 going in okay so birthdays I believe I'm only gonna stuff $14 because I notice there's two of them here I think what I'm gonna do for now on is knock out the multiple ones so then once we're down to like one of one of them then um, I'll pretty much just go in a rotation if, if you guys know what I mean. So anyways, uh, we're going to do 14 and birthdays. Okay, so now there's a total of 110, 15, 119 dollars in birthdays. Okay, so Christmas, we are doing twenty dollars because I noticed there is a lot of twenties on this envelope. So I need to start knocking some of those out. And my highest is still $30 on here. So I don't know when I'm going to be doing that one. Okay, so total is $150.70.84 in Christmas. 
Okay, so that's it for that binder. Okay, so graduations, we are only doing $10. Was I using orange or the light? I think I was using the light brown. See, this light brown color looks orange to me on when I color it. So I, I, I think it's weird, but it is what it is. So, ten dollars. Come on. Okay. We now have fifty, seventy, eighty, ninety five dollars in graduations okay next is student loan which is going to be 20 as usual Now we have $220 in student loans. So if you guys are wondering, I do pay a monthly for the student loan, like separately towards the end of the month. This is just when I get to that point of like, I'm almost done. Cause this is a total of $1,560. So if, I'm still paying, but I'm really close to this amount. Then hopefully if this is like filled up, I'll just like, here you go. That's all the money I have left <laughs> to pay you guys. Take it. <laughs> so I, I just because I'm almost there, guys. I think it's going to take like maybe another give or take. I'm hoping like less than three years, to be honest. But anyways, back to stuffing. So yay, I get to finally color my new savings challenge from uh, prints by Carly Studio. And I think, well, no, nah, I better stick with the brown because my tortoise, my leopard tortoise, I have a leopard tortoise. Uh, if you don't know, leopard tortoises is the fourth largest in of all the tortoises. So the first one is Aldabra. No, no, no. First one is Galapagos. Second is Aldabra. Third is Cicada. And then the fourth one is the leopard tortoise. So it's going to be like maximum size, maybe like the size of a soccer ball because it's in the medium range uh, of tortoises. So it's still, uh, I don't know if I would consider it a baby now. It's like three years old now so but it's still a little small it's not i think when they're five years old and older they're considered adults or fully grown so she's she's still got about like another two years till she's fully grown so i'm glad that i'm taking a little break with the reptile since i already have a hundred dollars um her food i might have to buy it sometime at the end of this year she still has enough food to probably cover her for the rest of the year. Um, I usually spend about $80 per, like, I wouldn't even say per year. Um, her food lasted for almost two to three years, I believe. So that's why I love reptiles, because um, you can buy, like, less than $100 of food, and it'll last for, like, quite a few years. So anyways, um... We're going to put $5 and it should be a total of 
105 because there's already $100 in here. Okay, so a uh, month ahead is getting $10 as usual. So let me turn it around. So I think I'm liking how I'm doing this in this video because I'm noticing there's less glare and my light is on. So I have the cash tray behind the binder to hold it up so the glare doesn't hit the, um, the laminates. <laughs> so there is a total of $110 in month ahead. And also with month ahead, if you're curious, like it's not exactly month ahead for me. I, I still also do pay separately towards the end of the month, um, like Amazon, Canva and all these other services. Um, but I really want to fill this whole thing up. So whatever the amount is like that will cover like my subscriptions like Amazon, Canva for who knows how many months hopefully I mean this would be great if this would cover like a whole year <laughs> of those like subscriptions but we'll see so once this is totally f filled up that's where the money will start being spent is covering those subscriptions and so forth so I believe we are done with um this envelope or this binder, excuse me. And now we're gonna go into Black Friday. So I did calculate out of curiosity how much I should stuff per week for Black Friday because we actually have 11 weeks left till Black Friday. And I wanna be able to finish this Black Friday challenge um, and I calculated I need to pay $44 a week in order to complete this and I can't do that <laughs> The most I can stuff that I feel comfortable stuffing um, If unless I owe money, but other than that if I don't owe money, I prefer to stuff at most $25 so Where is oh, there's my purple so I've decided that I'm only gonna stuff like either like this week we're going to do 24 or actually I think I'm just going to do 24 per week and then hopefully the savings challenges because I really want to try and complete more savings challenges per month will cover whatever you know I have left in this so I'm actually going to do the smaller denominations here because I feel like there's not a lot of progress on this savings challenge so I'm doing 20 Four, so let's do the dollars here. One, two, three, and four. And then we're going to do these fives. So we'll color in four fives. Okay, 24. Okay. So we have a total of 150, 70, 4, 5, 6, 7. So 177 dollars in Black Friday. Okay, going on into. Let me take this out. 
So, we are doing $10 in charity. So, let's color in this six. And this four. So we now have 50, 60, 70, one dollars in charity. So savings, we're gonna start doing the $15 bar here. So we're only stuffing $15 in this for this week. Okay, so we now have a total of $120.35 in savings. So emergency will get its regular $20. So now we have a total of 120 in emergency. And optical will also get its regular 20. So now there's a total of $160 in optical. And dental will also get $20. And now it also has a total of $160. Okay, now we should have about $75 in for the randomizer. So I have all my dice here. Let me actually roll the dice first and write them down. And I already crossed off everything on my sheet. Okay, so for the D4, it is number two. And then D6 is number six. And then D8 is number four. D10 is number 10 and then d12 is wait is that no that's six so that's number six as well and then the d20 is number 11. okay So, we're going to go backwards since we only have $75. So, D20 is number 11, which is Roth IRA. Ooh. So, Roth IRA is $20, and good thing we have a 20 here. So, let's find Roth IRA right here.
So now there is a total of $80 in Roth IRA. Okay, so D12 is number six, which is books. Wow. First time books is finally getting some money. So I'm using the Erica Budgets Challenge. I think it's one of the last ones that I decided to put. Yeah, so... This is from Erica Budgets, and it's called the Book Fund, and each box is $5, so that's all I'm going to put is $5 in here. And let's do a different color. Let's do, let's do green for this one. So $5 going into Book Fund. Okay, so D10 is number 10, which is Christmas. Totally fine with that. So, which one are we going to do? It's going to have to be the least amount. And the smallest amount I see here is $15. So that's what we're gonna do okay so we now have a hundred fifty seventy eighty ninety a hundred and ninety nine dollars wow almost there i just need a dollar more <laughs> but that will probably unless the d20 gets picked again for christmas that's probably not going to happen until next week so christmas and then d8 So D8 is number four, which is crossed off, so we're not doing that. And then D6 is number six, which is hospital. That one's gonna be, ooh, I don't know if we're gonna have enough. Because um, hospital is $20 each. Oh like why does that look weird <laughs> okay so here it is and it's actually finally going to get stuffed right because I just want to make sure yeah d6 number six so yeah each icon I made twenty dollars so actually I have the perfect amount okay good because all the rest I have is two and ones and whew, I don't know if we're going to make it. So $20 going in. Okay. So now D4 is number two, which, yep, it's wedding. Um, I know we have an IOU on that, which I will do. And I believe the IOU is $11. Future wedding, future wedding. So two, four, six, eight. 
9, 10, 11. So we have $4 left, guys. So I'm probably going to get another IOU. So that is done. Okay, so there's a total of 50, 70, 90, 2, 4, 6, 8, 100, 1, 2, 3, 4. So there is $104 in future wedding. So happy that I hit 100 finally on this one. So we have $4 left. I'm, I'm just going to roll the D20. I don't need to roll everything um, since I don't have a lot of money left. So let's just roll that. So number 18, which is Black Friday. I'm totally fine with that. Totally, totally happy and fine with that. And... I'm I'm so happy everything worked out. <laughs> I thought I thought I was gonna get an IOU, guys. Okay, so we're only gonna be putting four dollars. So one, two, three, four. Right. Yep, four dollars. Okay, the new total for Black Friday is a hundred fifty. Wait, what the? Hundred fifty seventy eighty two four five six seven eight nine. 191 dollars in Black Friday. Okay, that's pretty much it for my cash stuffing video. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you tomorrow for the savings challenge video. Please like and subscribe to my channel, and see you guys later.